Moss stitch and feed stitch are pretty similar, as you can see here. Right here is seed stitch, and this is moss stitch. So it's just a open version of seed stitch. See how this is more closed? This looks more open. So what you do for moss stitch is when you start the row, or when you look at this, with seed stitch, every, every row you do the opposite of how the stitch lies on your needle. With moss stitch, every other row you change it. So this is how you start. You would purl, knit, purl, knit all the way across. When you turn your work around, you do exactly how the stitches lie on your needle. So in this case, I would knit first, then purl. Knit and purl. All the way across. Now that you've done your two rows, how you would start your next one is you would do the opposite of how your stitches are lying on there. So I would do a knit purl. Then when I turn it around, I would knit them how they lie on the needle. Then when I turn it back around, I'll do the opposite of how they lie on the front. And that is how you get moss stitch.